Hello, this is Midland Four Six Dub. Uh, four. Sorry, let me start this again. <laughs> Hello, this is Midland Four Six Double O Productions here. Um, I think I've mucked this up again, but never mind. Um, sorry for um, a long wait since my last video was uploaded. I've been busy with my um, other YouTube channel. I've got uh, the main channel I normally do when I'm going out for these outings to Heritage Railway Galas and Mainline Steam Charters and Diesel events as well um, yeah I've just been more paying attention with that um, and uh, I've been doing like college uh, coursework and I've got this um, English exam coming up soon so I had to do that uh, so I'm just trying to do as much as I can on the train sim stuff I recently re received um, or newly appeared and try out and also I've been on War Thunder most of my time so I just haven't been <laughs> I haven't played train sim for quite a while since I've been on War Thunder most of the time so uh, yeah anyway let's, let's start um, so uh, I'm this is about the newly released um, London Transport Heritage Collection um, with the route that is kind of made up it's more or less what it will be in the future I don't know it, if it was but I'm just going to try out one of the scenarios I don't know which one but I'll just try out any one um, I think I'll try out the uh, the 1938 tube stock it was really it's a well it's the same thing as the Isle of Wight class 483 they just um put in the London Transport red livery and they changed the bit of the controls slightly so when you uh release the brakes you got on the Isle of Wight one you got one two and three and four so different notches on the throttle but on the 1938 stock on the Heritage Collection one. It has idle, shunt, and parallel, and has two forwards and one reverse on the controls. So it's not really much of a difference, really. It's just changed a bit in the uh, the train itself. But anyway, and also in the collection is the pannier tank also in London Transport Red Livery and I, I think that's really good um, the class 20 I've, I've recently got the class 20 without the light box on the front but this class 20 with the light box on the front looks really good but there's a slight issue with one bit the, the horn sounds alright in a way but only makes one noise, uh, one toot. And usually on the other class 20 pack, it has a two tone. So usually it sounds good with a two tone one than a, a one tone. But let's just just wait for this uh, scenario to upload and see how it all goes. And yes, it's just appeared. Uh, it takes a while. Uh, right. Good afternoon, driver. The 1938 tube stock is up first in the Heritage Collection. You will be in charge of this historic stock, startling from St Paul's in the north before making your way down south, ending at Vins Vindales, or whatever it says. Please allow passengers to board here before departing. Now, I've done this scenario before, and I'm trying to get used to pull away the station smoothly before, well, getting these driver quality penalty, penalty points. It just really annoys me most of the time, so... But the, there's a slight problem with this one. Uh, hang on, I'm supposed to board the train. Uh, I've just turned on the lights, and the lights doesn't seem like it's working. The rear lights are working, but the front lights doesn't. 
the interior is actually immaculate. It's better than the one we have on the Isle of Wight. And it's got some good ones up. But I think we're ready to go then. Just, uh, I thought I just heard the door shut in a way. Um, well, we got the right away. Um, we should be approaching Blackwater platform to 134. So let's try and try and pull away the station in a in a smooth sort of way. And put it into idle position because I don't want any more penalty there's penalty points I meant. <laughs> yeah, anyway. So far so good. I'm going at 15 miles an hour and we going to 40 miles an hour as this is the top limited on the map at the moment. So far, so good. No penalties here so far. Um, yeah, we'll see how it all goes then. Now I'm gonna use a mixture of the mouse and the keyboard to try and get this uh, the speed absolutely sort of spot on, but not too spot on. red livery. That's better than the um, Isle of Wight one. I think we're now approaching Breakwater's platform too. Yeah, and my graphics has just dropped. Uh, please refresh yourself. Please, please, please. Thank you. So we should be arriving seconds now. Speed up a bit. Now last time I did this scenario I overshot the platform and usually that kind of annoyed me. I think I slowed down too much for that. seconds late, but doesn't matter. And a nice gentle pull in and open the doors. We'll keep it on lap at the moment. So we've got one two, three, four stops before we get to the end of the line. So the first stop has been good, so we should be the same all the way. Just hoping it. Uh, 
my graphics has just been an absolute bastard again. Just a bit annoying. Please don't do this. Please, please, please. And I'll keep saying this again. I don't know if the uh, passenger view will do the same. No, it's not doing the same. It's just being cool. I get it. It's just... I just don't know why it's just done that, it's just annoying. It's absolutely annoying when it keeps glitching and then suddenly goes into lag mode for how many minutes and then it gets to a certain part, then it fixes itself. It's just too annoying. Anyway, we should be approaching... Sorry, I keep saying black waters, break waters. We should be Nope, it's not making a difference. Um, this pack, the London Transport Heritage Collection, this comes with the route. The route I'm on comes with the pack, just to let you know. Um, uh, I'm trying to remember how much it cost. Yes. Um, yeah, this pack costs like... Um, £11.99, so it's well worth it to get. Just one. Sorry, I'm just concentrating. I don't want to get any more penalties. Uh, station will be channel platform. We should be arriving in one minute's time. We just need to get into gear and try and get up this hill. The sand will work. No? Doesn't like it.
we're losing speed already, but we're just going up at one in, one in uh, 51 gradient. I'll keep my words together. beginning to start again. Short of the platform, but it doesn't matter. Uh, a few minutes late, but that's fine. We should be departing again soon. Uh, so we just only got two more stops to do, and uh, this should be good then. Now, since we're on a gradient, we want to pull it away as smooth as, po uh, as possible. And, yep, here it comes again, the uh, driver's quality, a bit annoying. Can't really avoid that, it's just annoying how it all falls away. Well, we lost uh, a few points of that. A bit annoying. Oh uh, well, it happens. It happens to most gamers anyway. That's why I normally stick to standards than careers. Because careers, their, their pointing systems are kind of ridiculous. You can't quite actually keep up with the times. Especially when you're driving like a steam train. You can't really... Uh, be early or on time because it's on on modern networks you you think oh you're gonna run on time or run early but no it just makes it worse on the American one it just really most of their times are ridiculously short and if you have a long heavy train and you can't pull away as quick as you can you wouldn't get on there on time you get a, a large amount of penalty points Shouldn't have been 
there now, but since my graphics is playing up, it's just making it late. Sorry, I'm back. Uh, I thought somebody knocked on my door. But, uh, nobody was there. <laughs> anyway, we lost a bit of time, but we'll try and pull away as much as we can. That's better. views but they're, they're more or less the same really what else should I talk about updates on the the channel itself um, I've recently been putting up uh, music videos from my favorite anime girl in Panther um, I'm hopefully going to put some more on in a month's time or week's time, I don't know, depends on what I'm doing. Um, I've also put other animates, uh, the last video I put up was the, uh, the, the new anime that was just released uh, a few weeks ago. Um, I'm trying to think of, of course I'm going to try and put some other games on onto this channel and try out, apart from when I'm actually just playing War Thunder and Train Sim as I usually do. Um, um, I think that was mainly it. I've only added like two more things in animate and music videos, as I usually like to make music videos anyway. done for the last stop of the trip, really. Um, let me just 
put this to off mode and should put into that setting at the moment. Or emergency, just hey, up. Oh. What the? What did I just see a person just walk through my train? Oh, anyway. <laughs> Good job, driver. So, since we didn't go up to a thousand, we only done about 792. But since that pull away wasn't very good, uh, we'll try it again next time. And we didn't kind of keep up with the date in these times. So at least we got silver in this way. So yeah, the forwards and back, yeah, that doubles them quite good. Um, so the next one we could try is the um, the pannier tank, really. Drive a bit of steam trains for a bit. <laughs> Please excuse that was Facebook. <laughs> Can have a look. Um, have a look at that later. I will hopefully do some reviews on War Thunder as well, the one of these new tanks and all that. But I have to sort out my recording systems to it, because it usually gives a lot of lag before you even actually playing the game. And I just really need to sort that out before I actually do any more to it. So, yeah. That's all. That's all I could say. I, I haven't got much words to say anything about <laughs> this anyway. Um, I think I'll do, let me just go back to my game and just continue. There it all goes. So another one, good morning driver, it's a pannier steam locomotive turn in the heritage collection. Your pannier is extremely low on water and starting from where we were on the last scenario, um, as the end, um, you will have to make your way down to Stony Point to fill up your engine before returning back to this place, I, as I can't actually pr pronounce it, so yeah. Let's just uh, board the passengers then. So we should go into forward gear. Uh, drain cocks open. I think the drain cocks are open anyway. Uh, headlamps on. That's better. And. Uh, Let's shovel some coal in it. Release the brakes. Put some sidelines on. And we should be off. And since this is realistic setting, be sure with the regulator. Going over the speed limit. So yes, I have the turn. Got the got the great uh, drain box shut. Good for my engine.
a bit more now. First stop is King Henry VIII Hulk Platform. Speed limit is now going to be 15 next, we should slow down. Going down here, we don't need to open much of the regulator. Off we go. Shut them again.
we're approaching the station. That's a reasonable speed. water tower here so we should disconnect here And I'm just going to use the handbrake and the vacuum. train and then go back where we were. That's a bit too fast. Slow down a bit. And that should... Ooh, that's a bit close. Oh, that's alright. And uh, we should be going again. Right, so our function time is now. And so we should pull away nicely. Got a 25, so we should be 
Now, the last time of this scenario, I went past the red signal without looking. So, I should be aware of looking out for this signal. And it must be that signal over right there. This signal here, so I should be aware of that. I'd like to be sure. There's a yeah, it's a green signal there, so we should be fine. Crack open the right um, blower. That's enough water in the boiler. Eighty four percent of the boiler is fine. So the release brakes. Imagine there's a guard whistle and we should be on. here so we should slow down for that bit. Not too fast, just a bit slow enough to uh, not go past the red signal.
slowing down as we should. I'll try and get as close as I can to the signal without going past. It. And we got a green signal. We should be off then. And our speed limit's 15, so we do it. Well, this one went well, and board passengers here, and I think we're almost done, so I'm off to steam shed, so I should be that soon. Again. Oh, look again. Somebody's walking through. What? What? Um, okay. And the passenger just disappeared. We purposely just walked through my train. Right, so the steam ship is just down there.
So to be sure, put the handbrake on. Turn off the he uh, headlamps on. We can turn it on. Oops. Oh, no. And we got 100%. Hooray! Right, that's another scenario done. So we got, we're done two. And uh, we've unlocked the London Transport Heritage. One, another one. That's quite good. So far, so good. Um, I will do last uh, one last one before I end this all. Um, and yeah, so I was just only wanted to try the first three from three different stock. I've already tried the 1938 stock. I've already tried the Pannier. So the next one is to try is the class 20. So, one, two. I think this one should. Oh, I don't know. I'll try this one. Excuse me. Not much to talk about here at the moment. Uh. Right, last one. Uh, good morning, driver. It looks like good evening, but isn't it? Good morning. Excuse me, I've got parents coming into the door. Excuse me. Sorry, I'm back. Continue what we're doing. Uh, so I should be collecting something. Up there. So we we'll turn to the back. Turn to there.
be looking at it. It's it's really good. I like the livery of the uh, London Transport Class 20. Can't say anything else with this one. It's just really good. wagons at the end of the um, docks here and then we have to load them up onto uh, over here so this should be good driver's quality Alright, that's my phone. I should switch that off.
cars again. Somewhere there is a, a signal you had to well, I have to go past. Like I said, the horn isn't that good.
almost finished. Slow down it to sheds. Well, at least we've done 961 for this scenario. So, so far, um, we got a bad score in the 1938 stock one. We've done a very good, sc well, I've done a very good score on the Panya tank, because I'm usually good on steam. And the diesel, apart from that driver quality hidden into the uh, freight wagons, wasn't that good. We got 961 so that was pretty good so really to say about this route it I'll give this as a, um, a 7 out of 10 because just the, the class 20 and uh, the, the class 20's horn sometimes it works with the 2 turn and sometimes it doesn't but yeah you can get this from Steam Railworks it's £11.99 for this pack if you want it get it soon why am I saying it soon it's always on there so yeah that, that's it from me um, what to say next I've forgotten what to say next um, <laughs> um, so yeah just give us a like on this stream uh, and um, just subscribe for more videos in the future. I'm, I don't know when, but <laughs> soon. Um, as soon as I finish my education, since I'm actually doing some. So um, yeah, that's for, that's it from me. So I'll see you next time. Bye.